Steve, we are in a game yes, that's oh. not. We are not getting a game that's getting pretty much universally panned, <laughs> from what I can, what I've read. Yeah. Redfall, as you said. So we're in to see what this, what the fuss is all about. Uh, I've played for about forty minutes. Um, you can play this game solo if I can, if I think. Yes, you can, because I played this for about just over an hour ten. Yeah, so we've both got. I don't know how far you got in. I just basically unlocked this fire station, sort of central hub place. I went past. I went past this and did the first mission and got um, the first region unlocked. Uh, oh, fair enough. Done on that. Okay. Uh, so at the moment, I've got a mission somewhere. Where are the quest lines? You gotta talk to the. You gotta talk to Reverend Eva. Where is she? Is she upstairs? Where is she? Literally right here. Right. Is that her? Okay. Cool. Talk to her. You must oh. be Layla. I'm sorry you got wrapped up in all this. We all got wrapped up, didn't we? I'm Reverend Eva. It's nice to meet you. Sorry it couldn't be under better circumstances. We were at the homeless shelter before this, but... Anyway, I do the organizing around here. Good for you. Sending people for yeah. supply runs, scavenging, getting people to safety. Sometimes they bring back useful stuff. Check the trunk from time to time. Whatever's in there is yours. If we can spare it. If you have the currency for it. Oh, okay. So there's one currency. What have we got? I've got 350 coins. They want over a thousand. Okay, that ain't gonna happen. Mm. Right. Fortunately, there is only one currency. That's something. Something to be thankful for. Yeah. Uh, some of our allies in the fire station. So we're both probably still going through tutorial stuff. So that's what I'm getting. Um. Some of your allies in the fire station can run supply caches where you can spend support. Which is what? The, that's, is that the currency? That's the currency. Okay, do stock up on news lines, blah, 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 check back occasionally. Alright. Yeah. So, the last one is, I'm going to talk to this pregnant lady. Alright. Say yeah, goodbye, yeah. Joe. Goodbye, Joe. Lady, ah! Nice to meet you. <laughs> Ah, that's like one of the few bits of clever writing in this, yeah. oh, this thing I've played so far. This is my husband, Joe. You ran into one of those creeps, yeah? Only way to kill him is with a stake to the heart. Makes him pop like a firework. Those loonies? Boston. You can take out with a regular gun, though. And we got plenty of those. This stake's free, but you gotta earn the guns out of my stash. Sorry. She's not sorry. <laughs> I ain't sorry. Anyway, nice to meet you. Things ain't gonna be so easy for this little guy. Uh, yeah, no. Nah. Way the world is. I found so far that the um, my side the division that the weapons you can buy aren't as good as some of the weapons you'll find out or as mission rewards. Okay, yeah, which is probably what you wanted the game to do. Yeah. Uh, you can re you can re you just received a new state. You can use the custom and everything. Oh, that's great. Yeah, fair enough. Um, so yeah, so the other thing we probably didn't we didn't show in this video is that at the beginning of this game you select a character. Mm. There are four to choose from. Uh, I think there's four. Pretty sure it's four. Yes, yeah, four. Um, and each of them seem to have like three abilities. Uh, yes. Which I think I've unlocked one of them already. Just some sort of. I have two. Um, some sort of shield thingy, Bob. Which I got immediately first leveling up, so it wasn't particularly hard to get it. Um, mm. So, uh, so what are we doing? A oh, mission. Briefing. I'm gonna use this pool table. Pull up. All right, re mission briefing. All right. Two birds, one stone. All right, accept mission. Okay, this much is true. One, my name is Layla Ellison. Two, Redfall is full of blood. So yours will be monsters. having your character do the narration on this and part, three? aren't you? Yeah, yeah. I have these yeah, my, and whereas mine, I've powers. got to my character doing it. Okay. That makes sense. Yep. That Otherwise, one? there's a lot of things I'm not so sure about. I'd be curious if the dialogue you get is the same as mine, but I wouldn't, wouldn't have thought so. Wouldn't have thought so. I was yeah. in the master's degree, everything seemed normal, everything except the missing people? Yep, nope. Yep. <laughs> Fair enough. And the weird symbols everywhere. So at some, uh, during this mission we'll get the ability to hit a safe house. Oh, okay, yep. So literally I did this mission, the safe house, and a few other bits and pieces in like an hour ten. Because of okay. course they did. Now we're all trapped here. No one is coming to help us. No one is going to tell us what to do. The people hold up here need supplies. In and out, downtown, just to pick up some stuff. 
It'll be easy. <laughs> right? Alright. Now we can leave. Click supplies for the fire station. Yep, fair enough. Some map stuff as usual. The best, like, the funniest thing that's happened to me so far is, like, walking up to the fire station. I killed two, um, two just dudes hanging out, two cultists. I was standing next to a car. The car wasn't on fire, at least it didn't seem like it. it fucking blew up. <laughs> what the hell? Oh my god, there could be survivors. Then let's get over there, shall we? Your children crying out for me. I need you here. And you need me to be well. I have brought you down from the sky. I am the Hollow Man. Um, what the hell was that? The Hollow Man? That sounds like something out of a horror movie. But, uh, I guess we're in one. You can close to your friends, grants, gameplay advantages based on how much trust you've built, higher trust, low and lost more conversations. Hmm. Oh. Interesting, interesting mechanic. Hmm. So what, what, alright, you've got a shotgun with a stake. Yeah, I've only got the one though. Yeah. I got this dope barnacle shotgun. Ooh, cool. I got Death Eagle. Yeah, so I've also got just a standard. Probably the same gun as you, I suspect, for the first one. No, I got a, I got a level 4 handgun from a mission or something. Oh, okay. And then I got an assault rifle. Yep. So one of the biggest criticisms so far about the combat is that there's next to no recoil on the assault rifles. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Like, you can literally just... Brap, brap, brap. Yeah, okay. It takes very little, there's... yeah. There Alright. Where are we going? So M's the map key, so you can go in and set a waypoint. Yeah, I'm using controller, so I wonder what that button is. Ah, oh, here we go. Uh. Map. Okay, we've got one helicopter. We'll go... Waypoint. Place ping. That one, I'm guessing. Here we go. There we go. It, pin it did put a pin on mine, too. Yeah, cool. Go here. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so at the moment, like, the, we've seen, I've been up, I've played this only for like 45 minutes you now. You studied but, Biomed, right? Um, Have you given any thought to where all the extra tissue comes from when the vampires regenerate? Are you serious? They're trying to kill us! Absolutely! All that cellular differentiation is fascinating! Ah, <sighs> dork! <Yeah. laughs> that was pretty good. That yeah, was good. Um, yeah, so the, we've... We're fighting against this like vampire horde, but I've only defeated one vampire, which is part of the main mm. mission to get into that firehouse. We just were in. Everyone else has been they've been humans, so yeah, they're called, cultists. They're, cultists is just the term given to them all. You get into that? Nah. Uh, pity. There is a safe house around here somewhere. Where is it? We haven't got close enough to it yet. We are coming up on it. Do you have bellwether sni a bellwether sniper on top of this roof I'm aiming at? Uh, there's a go with it. Yeah, definitely go with the gun there, that's for sure. Yep, bellwether <laughs> sniper. Hey, listen. We could use your help getting some safe houses set up while you're out there. The more places folks have to lay low, the better. It'll also get the foothold to take back our neighborhoods from the goddamn cults. My friends already laid the groundwork in a few places, but as you can imagine, they're not really safe yet. If you spot one, just get the power going and give us a shout on the radio. So that's... I think it's one of these houses around here. I think it's this one. Uh, 220 degrees. Uh, up, the, up in the hill up there. Okay. Yeah, I think it's that one. 
Oh no, never mind. It's this one over here. For a safe That's house. over here. Yeah, okay. Just needs a bit of UV protection. Oh yeah, you've done it. I yeah, know, right? You're dead. Next time, just let me go. Thank you. Anywho. One of the reasons I don't like first person perspective games is I just lose all content of where I am in the world. Apparently the POV and the, like I haven't had too much of an issue with it, but the PO, the POV or no FOV is fairly narrow. Uh, okay, maybe that's one. So that may be something of an issue as well. So the safe house entrance is here. Yep. I'm guessing we're getting there. There's going to be more to shoot. Nope. Ah, I don't think so. Yeah. Oh, that was easy. Oh, okay. Thank you. So, this curtain over here, see how it's got a map drawn on it? Uh, yeah, yep. You can come up and there's actually missions you can do. Uh, okay. And then, like, there's this Bellwether supply drop. And then, once you do that, you can defeat an underboss. So that then secures this whole section of the map. Uh, okay, fair enough. It, since we're here. So we can do that or we can or we keep going with our um We'll just mode. keep going because you've already got it set, it just it just puts it on the um on the map, mission yeah. queue. Yep. Oh okay, I've got skill points to do as well. Okay. Ooh, rewire kit. Let me try this first one. I mean, actually, no, yeah, I do have this, I look at the skill tree and it's like, there's not much here that I'm actually finding particularly useful. I've not even used it at all yet, so... Mm. <laughs> I completely forgot about it, even had the thing. Alright, let's go down, follow our blue arrow down here. Oh, should we go this way? So that red mist shit you see? Don't go through it. Don't go, yeah, don't go through it. It's uh, it's bad. Uh, I'm in the wrong side of this. Do we need to go up? Nah, I th uh, we go around this side. Okay. On a, up, up here. Okay. Because there's a log that we can use to walk across. Okay. Yeah, over here. Hey, uh, gotcha. Yep. first time I came through here and saw this blood mist shit, my dude was like, oh, mist, red, blood mist, duh. What is that red stuff? It doesn't look healthy. Health stuff. How about we don't touch it? Yeah, get him! You come out? I'm like hip firing dudes from like 20, 30 meters away. How many is that? Mm, shotgun's good. The shotguns are particularly effective. Mm. And again, you can just walk up on a dude and blast him one in the head with a shotgun from a fair decent distance away, too. Yeah. <laughs> wow. 
Alright, what are we doing? Use that radio. Hi, uh, working? This is Sharon. I hear ya. We're coming up on the second chopper now, no sign of life. I don't think any of these Bellwether soldiers made it. You? Still looking for those supply crates they built. I, I don't think we should be on these radios too much. <laughs> Why? What if they're listening? Why if they send more soldiers? You know who's listening? The Hollow Man. He served these choppers up to us on a platter. So just make sure you get those goddamn supply crates. Huh. There are supplies for the taking. We could get a jump on those cultists. We still gotta get to the other helicopter, though. Hey, can we get this? Oh, the. So there's a burst fire assault rifle in this crate I've just unlocked here. See, I've got. So I had a shotgun before and I picked up another assault rifle. Have I still got the shotgun or have I dropped it? Oh, you should have the shotgun in your um, inventory. Inventory? How do I know that? Okay, yeah, I do. Okay, cool. So, like. I was watching a video of this, and the burst fight, the burst assault rifles seem to be fucking awful. Okay. Like you know how you can just spam the trigger button to just like burst, burst, burst. Yeah. Yeah, nah. You have to hold the trigger down to complete the burst, then do it again. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> What's the weapon you've got for in here? Is it an assault rifle or is it something else? Uh, I think I picked up a semi-automatic shotgun. I think. I'm gonna pick up. I'm just gonna choose a different. But I have now got a actual assault rifle, automatic mm. assault rifle. Yeah, burst fire ones are fucking shit. Yes, yeah, so I didn't I'm get gonna... one. Of, I didn't get one of those. I just got a. I think I got a shotgun of some sort when I picked it up. I'm gonna equip it just so I can show what it actually is like. Oh my god! So me like those single shots I'm doing. Yep. That's me tapping the mouse button. And I'm getting yeah. like two, like at least a click or two between shots. Yeah, okay. And it takes a good second or two from clicking it again to re trigger. That's fucking terrible. Mm. Hold on, let's put the auto rifle back in. So have we done that quest that we just doing? No, no, there's another one. Okay, we've got to go there, we've got to go there, crash shot. Oh, yeah, okay. yeah, that makes sense. So, how far away is the... Um, I'm going to mark the supply drop as a thing. Okay. Which I actually don't think I can. Oh, it's the yellow thing on the map. On hey, the you, yeah, you've marked it. Supply crate, yep. We need to do it alone now, yeah. Rest day together. I wonder how far away they consider it to be, quote unquote, together. I don't know. Like, I was probably about. So, when you when you said that, I was still at the um, crash site. So, that's probably. Mm. What would that have been? 50 meters, maybe? I don't know. Mm. Do you have the pin I set? set? What? The what? Do you have the pin, the pin I set, set for the other helicopter? Sorry? Do I have the what set? The pen, the pin, um, the pin. No, I haven't. Got it. No, no, I haven't. No. Okay. But I think it's marked anyway because it's part of the mission, <gasps> I suspect. Yeah. I went looking through the options menu to see if there was a way to like just press to hold, uh, to aim, or to run. There's no option for that. Oh, okay. Well, control this. You tap it in and toggle it on or off. Yeah. Whereas on a uh, mouse and keyboard, you have to hold shift to sprint and hold the right mouse button to aim. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. There's probably, no... By the sounds like you probably have to play toggle. with the controller. <laughs> mm. I forgot this supply crate one was so close. Supply crate dead ahead. Uh... Maybe not the best choice of words. <laughs> I was gonna say. Let's open it. Assuming we're gonna get... Supply crate secure. 
<laughs> Once I'm really? back at the fire station, I'll let them know where it is so they can collect it. I'd better I'll get over Anna to the know other crash site so first. someone can grab it. Should still check out that other helicopter before going back. Huh. I do refill ammo and I've only got four shotgun shells. What the fuck? Ah, oh, whatever. All right, let's go the other. Let's go the other helicopter. Yeah. See, I went into the map, cleared my pin off it, and you put yours down, and it showed up for me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Use the bellwether communications laser to call in a supply drop. Mm -hmm. What the fuck is that again? Oh, I guess. Ooh, that's my ability. Okay. Oh, check it out. See how little recoil there actually is? Ha! Yeah. Still alive. Wild. Uh, it's super simple. Ha! I got my ultimate. So how many? How do you know how many stakes you've got? Do you ever? Do they? Do they, do they run out? You know? So the stakes that are actually on your gun, no. Uh, okay. So you do get some guns that are mount that have a stake mounted on the front. Like the assault rifle you're carrying has one. It has one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but you got to shoot the vampire enough to weaken it, then you go up and stake it one. Yeah, yeah. But that other um, that other woman said imply that they can. There's handheld or... ones which I've never used. Okay. Well, yeah. I mean, again, I only played it for about an hour, but. Yeah. Hey, look, vampire. Something to play with. Where'd he go? Bam! <laughs> go stake it, Graham. Just one bite. Good hustle. It's like the um bayonet on the gun in Gears of yeah. War. <laughs> it's very much an execution, like yeah, chainsaw yeah. gun. But like when that vampire was up on that cliff. Aim three shots, and it's almost got no health left. Yeah. So uh, the combat is fairly simple. Mm. Oh, that's the wrong right again. Hey, you. Stay Take up. electricity. Delve into that. Thank you. Take cover. An umbrella. Mm. Yeah, shut up. Shut up and take cover. I have a translocator as well. Ah, fuck. I just wasted it. Get him. Yeah. Another one bites the dust. I am unstoppable. Translocating. What the hell? Oh, uh, that! Did I just use so it? Didn't work. Hey? Oh, that wasn't particularly useful. <laughs> hey, I got up the cliff. I got up the other side of the cliff. Interesting. I could actually use it myself. When you use oh, it, could I, you? yeah, it said use it, and I was able to use it. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah.
Wait a second. Don't, don't move. Okay, so you do little barrels explode. Good. Of course they do. Oh, thing. Oh, they can even oh, okay. Are you seriously telling me the four is the max ammo I've got for a fucking shotgun? Oh, now, alright, it was some weird bug thing where it wasn't actually showing it properly. Oh, okay. Dickhead. Where the heck's we going? Where's this bloody helicopter? Up the cliff. Quite a view from up here. Oh, Red okay. Bull certainly looks dramatic. Uh, I just had shot a dude with a pistol from a fair decent distance. <laughs> hey, you. I could die. Oh, damn it. Sure about that? Are you getting XP when they die as well? I have no idea. Not paying any. Not, not really paying nice. attention. <laughs> might not be. I might be. I might I not be. Help with that. What's up? I can help. What is it? There you go. Way better. <laughs> Did you just get 25 XP? I think so. Yeah, I think we're probably sharing it. That's the fix. Okay, there's the helicopter. Gotta take a closer look. Who were they? What were they doing here? They sure aren't search and rescue. I imagine they serve... serve... private interests. <laughs> oh, whoops. Fire. Hold on. Looks like these bellwether troops were here to do some sort of damage control. Burning evidence. That's not on. <laughs> okay, so I'm getting a prompt that we've done that mission, I can just hold down a button to go to the fire station, so. Yeah. But we still got the um there is also that side mission for the using the bellwether Ow. Ow. The bellwether laser for the supply thing or some shit. Uh, oh okay, fine. yeah. It's fine. There's a crate here by the way if you want to open it. I already have. Just that one there, the one that was locked. Which one? There's oh one this one. That one there, yeah. Sorry. There's an a, a portable UV thing, which I'm like, nope. Don't want it. So we salvage it. What's that swiping in here? Huh. Intermission snack. That's weird. No. I reach here the fire station. I'm gonna try something. I wanna see if I can throw it, how far I can throw my trans. Wait! Oh, you fast traveled back to the fire station. Yep. Shit. UV beam. In. Okay, so we've got some UV beams. Yeah. Me. <laughs> Second I just building. translocated off the cliff. I can create an elevator. Bounce you into the air. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Any more you're going to tell me about? No. All right. Ah. Right, you'll get another ability at level five, which will be your ultimate. Yeah, uh, okay, fair enough. Hi. Ah, oh, I remember what I know what this intermission snack is now. What are you talking about? What? There's an yeah, exclamation mark that said intermission again. snack. Could make things seem it's to fix this popcorn normal, machine. Yeah, right? uh, okay. Yeah, fair enough. Hmm. Well, I kind of think we want to show off this game enough. There, th this is basically what it is, and like yeah. it, the the only other thing that's not really shown that isn't particularly well shown off is just relatively how empty the open world actually is. 
Yeah, like that's the thing. Like we've only when we come up to certain things that have actually got, mm. you know, enemies. So the different. quadrant did the the part of the map that had those two helicopters in it. Yep. Let me just open it up. Yep. So that part with the helicopters in it and all that sort of deal. That's you secure that by doing one that side mission from the safe house. Oh, that one, that safe house. That's that shade tree supper club. That thing. Is that right? Oh, the bellwether supply drop. Oh, okay. Where's that thing? Oh, there it is. Uh, no, that's the hillside. Should be under your missions, under safe house. Under safe house. Ah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Gotcha. Yep, okay. Yeah. So you actually go to a part on a bridge where there's a bunch of bellwether dudes and there's an actual mounted laser. Uh, and okay. you call in two supply drops from there. Uh, okay. Then you go and get them and defend them and get them, I guess. Yep. Okay. But like, you do that what that one safe house mission, and then it's like, hey, go kill this underboss. And now you've secured this part of the neighborhood. And it's like, yay! Okay, so it's, yeah, okay. So it's got a bit of... Fair enough, yeah. There okay. are some side stuff in it, but the, the, uh, the volume of it is pretty, seemingly pretty small. What's that going to do? Well, the gun you're holding. Yeah. Use it on vampires. Oh, okay. Have you, have you seen Blade? Oh, a long time ago, yeah. <laughs> you know you know that massive fat dude that's the information dude? It's... No, I don't remember the movie that oh. I saw 20 years ago. No. The movie's great. What are you talking about? I'm not saying the movie's not great. I just don't remember it. It's 20 years ago. Yeah. Seriously. They use a UV light to cook a big fat vampire dude. That's kind of what you've got. Oh, uh, fair enough. Okay. Alright, cool. I think we've, um... I don't mind this, to be honest. It's not... Like, it's not nothing to... Like, it's not... I don't... I, I've all seen a lot of the, the highlights... The, not the highlights. The headlines about it to imply that this game is really, really bad. I don't don't think it's that bad. I've seen, I I've seen, I've seen headlines that basically say this is basically the end of Xbox because of this game's release, which is absolutely fucking batshit insane. Um, but yeah, like it's not brilliant, but it's not diabolically bad. I mean, it might not be have much to it. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, to me, to me, it's a pedigree thing with Arcane, and it's that thing where it's like the big AAA games that Marks or the bigger games that Microsoft has put out recently have not been up to a certain standard. Like this, it's not like the worst thing in the world. You can actually like, particularly if you're playing in co-op. You could definitely run around and have your sense of fun and just doing, like, just run around shooting the shit and doing... Mm, yeah, exactly. Like, yeah. trying to shoot this thing. Yeah. But, like, the the complete lack of recoil on the assault rifle, meaning you can headshot dudes from across a bridge from hip fire. Yeah, no. I mean, There's elements like that. Yeah, like, this thing, like, it's not, as I said, it's not perfect. No. But to say it's bad and it's the end of Xbox because of its release, I think, is absolutely fucking insane. This is what I've read. I mean, that, like I said, is just that concept of... The big games that Microsoft has had, where it's like, yo, this is, this is why you get to oh, play games on Xbox or within the Xbox infrastructure, but the big ones haven't hit. Yeah, I get. I mean, yeah, yeah I what get, I mean. I guess I get, if that's a narrative you're going to take, then that's fine. But I just don't that, think that's that... seemingly that. That to me is my interpretation of the narrative. Not necessarily that the Xbox or the Xbox Game Pass service or anything is in serious trouble. Shut up. Um, but like, the big releases have either been small in number, because like, I wouldn't count Pentiment as a big release. That was well received, but it's also not a big release. No, sure. Whereas like, like where the big, big games are coming from Xbox, it's been sort of lacking. I think the next one up on the schedule is either Forza or Starfield. Yeah, I just, I, I, I mean, I get what you're saying. I just don't fully agree with that stuff. The end of Xbox because this game hasn't. Oh yeah, it's not. Just it's that that's just never going to be the end of Xbox. But, but I think I've that's literally, the literally life. saw a headline that literally said that. Oh um, really? I've literally said, "What's next for Xbox now? This game's come out and it's so bad. It's just, oh. it's just ridiculous, over the top nature of it all." But anyway, that is what it is. That's what it is. I think we could find dumb, fun things that. The, ooh. 
That was a bit of a performance hitch there. Yeah, I think there's enough in this game that you could get some fun out of it for... Yes. 10, 15, 20 hours and then you walk away from it and not think about it at all. Yeah, never think about it again. Yeah, I don't... Yeah, I don't think there's anything... I also never would have thought I'd say that about an arcane game. Not, I'm now not their biggest fan. Like, Dishonored and Dishonored 2 are pretty great. But I was never the type to play them multiple times to find the multiple routes through it and things yeah, like that. Yeah, I, I, was, I was the same. And I, I played through each at least once, if not twice. Once on a console and once on PC. Yeah. Death of the Outsider I really enjoyed. Deathloop we all know I fell off of after yeah. about 20 hours. But this doesn't seem to have the same intricacies as a... No, but I don't know if it ever was meant to. That's what I'm yeah. getting at. I think I think their, um, their reputation preceded them, which is not necessarily a bad thing per se, yeah. but it does set an expectation that maybe this game is never going to be. Yeah. But I don't know. I, I wasn't really paying much attention to its its review, like previous stuff before it came out. So. To me, you say Vampire Far Cry, and that sounds all right, because that's pretty much what this is. Yeah. It's just their needs more in the open world. Oh, the open world is definitely very empty. There's no doubt about yeah. that. There's no... That's like, that's one of the biggest complaints about this thing, is just how empty the open world is. And that's a fair complaint, for sure. Like, you compare yeah. this to, like, even The Division, which has got always mm. sort of roaming enemies and batches and stuff going through. Like, there's none of that between these two... Between buildings, even... Even some of the buildings don't have anything. What's over here in this big building over here? It's a bridge. It's a bridge. Oh, it's just a bridge. Oh, there's enemies inside. See if you can, sna you, you can smack him from here. No, it's not. It's a sign. <laughs> <laughs> Just had a shape of those enemies from the. From stand there the... for a second. Mm -hmm. I'm standing in this weird little spot. No, I'm not going to stand in it. You'll burn me. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> like even the fact that we're shooting this this car, and oh, the shotgun does damage to it. Yeah. But the other guns... Can, uh... Like when we were looking at that before, the... Shit. I don't know. Um, the, um... Way better. The rifle was, wasn't doing any damage, like, wasn't leaving any marks on it, is what I should say. Mm. Yeah. And I think that's probably a, an indication that it's, um... Not... Eh. It's not leaving any... Oh, yeah, that one is, actually. But it wasn't breaking the glass before. No, the glass started, yeah, like shooting the cop car out front of the fire station, yeah, not breaking that, the glass yeah. and things like that. Yeah, like that sort of stuff, like it's sort of... Not this game's there are certain emergent qualities you kind of expect in an open world game yeah, like this in 2023. Yeah, regardless of who makes it, that's what you kind of expect yeah. it to do, but this one's not doing that. What do these cultists even want? What are they going to do once everyone's And like, even, like, them oh, there's another... Food. Oh! Just my assumption. There's another house. safe house. Yeah, I don't believe get they've thought that far like, ahead. I, I compare this to Far Cry 6, which, despite finishing Far Cry 6, victory, I didn't think party. it was great. Yeah. Like a safe house up ahead. But I, it's a lot better than this. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, get him! Oh, there's a turret. Oh, hello. Oh no! Oh Jesus Christ! <laughs> Sweet, we both died. <laughs> both died. All right, I think it's a good point to call it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like I think there is pretend. Oh fuck me, we're back at the. Oh, we're back at the other. No, back at the. We're at the firehouse. What the hell? Yeah, not surprising. To respawn us, that makes sense. Um, I think there is fun to be had, but I don't. This to me, it it's. IGN gave it four out of ten. Which I, th I think that's probably fair. Like I think it's probably mm. correct. And like, based, just based, yeah, based on that sparsity of content. But you can still have fun with a four out of ten game, like Combat Master, which that um, Call of Duty, like I talked about on the podcast. Mm. That was, I would almost argue, that was actively bad, and I enjoyed my time in the well, I spent making that video. Yeah, yeah. Partly because I was winning. <laughs> but the the larger narrative of Xbox is in trouble because of this? No. But potentially a discussion to be had about where are Xbox's bigger games. Yeah, I just... My point is they don't need them. Like, the yeah. Sony, that's the difference. They've got... They're making their money through Game Pass, which I'm not saying that's necessarily a good thing per se, 
but because they de these games don't necessarily land particularly well, doesn't mean that all of a sudden they they they're not going out of business. Not the game, but people aren't saying they're going out of business. They're basically saying there's no point getting an Xbox. I've said that for yeah. a long time. You don't need to buy one. No. That's the point. But they're not making. That's their main purpose of buying having the mm. ecosystem is what they're after, not the necessarily the consoles per se. Yeah. They're not saying they don't want to buy sell consoles either. So it's a bit of a mixture there. But oh, what's the face? I got off. She was talking somewhere. Yeah. Anyway, let's call it. Let's call yeah. it. I think we've done it. I think we've shown off enough of this that I think people get a sense of what it's about. Will yeah, you continue playing it? I don't think. I think this will be a co-op co only game. To be honest with, for me, it'd be a game that if I, I play with you, maybe maybe do this as a series when we don't want you know when we don't have anything I'm else to play. Trying to figure out anything else to do, it's just like <laughs> yeah, just do Redfall for you know an hour or so. But as a game, I'd go back to my personal myself. Mm, probably not. Yeah, I think it's a co-op. This, this is a group experience game, like a division, like like we've yeah, like well, we've played other games. But yeah, the reflection on this fire, on this floor is pretty nice. Yeah, I mean, it's not a bad looking game per se. No, it's fairly straightforward, but it's 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 more than like it's it's adequate. There's nothing really overly bad about it. Well, yeah, some of the weapon stuff might be a bit bit weird, but yeah, I don't think there's a necessarily a a massive issue with this. Anyway, that's Redfall. Thank you, Steve. Thank you, Graham. We'll see everybody in the next video, whatever that happens to be. <laughs> yes.